Here's a 50 microamp full scale analog display. I want to modify that to read 250 milliamps full scale so I can have it on the bench just to hook up to circuits and monitor the current. So let's see how we do that. The method we use to increase the full scale range is called using a current shunt and to figure out the value of that current shunt we need to kind of characterize, find the specification of this meter. Uh, the actual full scale deflection current plus the voltage across the meter at full scale. And the way I'm going to do that is just use a power supply with a variable resistor and then we'll monitor the uh, current in that circuit when it reaches full scale and then we'll measure the voltage across the meter. And we'll use those values to calculate the current shunt uh, for 250 milliamps. Here's the connections. There's your variable resistor to adjust for full scale deflection. I've got two digital multimeters, one to measure the voltage across the analog display, the one to measure the actual current of uh, full scale deflection. I'm going to adjust my little variable resistor here to get full scale deflection. And there it is. The voltage across the uh, meter in full scale we'll say 242 millivolts. Full scale deflection current is we'll say 52 microamps. Well to calculate the value of the uh, current shunt it's uh, the voltage across the meter at full scale minus the max current of the meter in full scale current. And if you do the math on that it comes out to be 968 milliohms. If you do some math, you can find that a 30 ohm resistor and a 1 ohm resistor, those are common values, all that turns out to be pretty close to the uh, shunt resistor value of 0.968 ohms. So I'm using a 4 wire measurement. The measurement is 0.97 ohms. That's pretty close. Now I set my current limiting on my power supply to about 300 uh, milliamps and we'll slowly uh, Crank up the voltage here and see where we get full scale reading. That looks about right. And the current is 249 milliamps, so that's not too bad. So My burden voltage across the meter at full scale deflection, 241 millivolts. Oh, I just attached it to the back there, put some gook on it with some test leads and, and there I have a little 250 milliamp meter for the bench and I'll label it and uh, that'd be good. Hope you enjoyed the video. Wish you the best. See you.